Ray, this is Erica Bryant with Channel 9. A Channel 9 exclusive, former Carolina Panther Ray Carruth speaking from behind bars. I'm excited just for him being out of here. Days before he's set to be released. I just want to truly be forgiven. I asked him about his plans for life after prison and what he wants for his son. I just wanted him to see his father face to face. I wanted him to know that I do want to be there, that I do love him. After nearly 19 years behind bars, former Carolina Panther Ray Carruth now has just four days and nights left in prison. And tonight, you'll hear from him only right here on Channel 9 as he reflects on his time behind bars and looks ahead to his release. Good evening. I'm Paul Boyd. I'm Erica Bryant. Now, Ray Carruth had originally agreed to meet with me in person at the prison in eastern North Carolina where he is completing his sentence. But yesterday, the head of the state's prison system said that could not happen. So instead, Carruth spoke with me by phone, and he had a lot to say. I just want to truly be forgiven. Ray Carruth has had nearly 19 years to think about the crimes committed, and in that time, he's gone from a young man to middle age. I spoke with him by phone. How are you feeling as you are about to walk out of prison after all of these years? I'm excited just by being out of here. Um, nervous just about how I'll be received by the public. I still have to work. I have to live. I have to exist out there. And it just seems like there's so much hate and negativity towards me. I'm actually somewhat frightened. So I just, you know, it's a lot of, it's a mixed emotions, but mainly I'm just worried about how I'll be received. He insists his emotions are not mixed when it comes to his son, Chancellor Lee Adams. Chancellor Lee was born premature and with cerebral palsy because of the shooting that eventually took the life of his mother, Sharika Adams. Sharika's mother, Sandra Adams, has raised Chancellor from birth. He turns 19 next month. Carruth says once he's free, he'd like to see his son. Uh, so coming out of here, what means the most to me isn't regaining my freedom, but hopefully having an opportunity to find different ways to be there for my son that I didn't have while I was incarcerated. And so I asked, of course, how he wants to be there for his son. And he said in every way, including financially, if he can. 